What's going on everybody? Welcome to the Form Check Friday guidelines video. Now in this video, we're going to tell you how to submit for Form Check Friday and how to ensure that your video gets selected and not just deleted. So before we get into these rules, the big thing here, send your emails to formcheckfriday at gmail.com. Don't send them anywhere else. Send them to formcheckfriday at gmail.com. Formcheckfriday at gmail.com. Also, that email address is in the description of, I think, every video we make. At very least, it's in the description box of every Form Check Friday. So if you forget, just check there. Now let's get into the six rules for selection in Form Check Friday. Rule number one, put your name and the lift that you want critiqued in the subject line. Now that's a big one because we use the search function a lot of times. We want things to go in a nice neat order, squat, bench, deadlift throughout the episode. And if you don't put that in the subject line, it's really hard for us to find it. Number two, please send one lift per email. Don't send one email with three lifts in it because then we don't know what to select. And uh, if you send each of them separately, you can send up to three emails per three months. And we'll talk about that in a second. Next, number three, give context. If you send in a video with no subject line, no body of the email, and no explanation of what's going on, who you are, why you're lifting, what you want to do, or if you notice any of the flaws yourself, your chances of being selected really diminish. If you can take the time to give us a little bit of context, then you're more, more likely to be selected. And our fourth rule here is resist sending singles, especially failed lifts. Now, a lot of people want to send in these balls to the walls, max attempts with weights that they've never even looked at loaded on a barbell before. And honestly, my critique most of the time is, well, that was too much weight. You're going to need to get stronger. And that's not useful to anybody. So what I'd like you to do is send in lifts in the 75 to 95% range for two to five reps. Just send in a working set at RPE eight or nine, or even 10, as long as there are a few reps and we can see some technique breakdown, we can see some changes in technique, it's it's tough a lot of the times to tell with a single. So um, a little bit more reps per set will help us do a better job. So please don't send singles. Next up, it is important to note now, um, previously we did a video like this and we talked a little bit about landscape versus portrait and that doesn't matter. Don't worry about whether it's landscape, whether it's portrait, it's not a big deal. The important thing is gonna be camera angles. So I would like for you to set up a camera so that we can see your full body. If it's from the bench, try not to go straight on from the side, try to get a little bit of an angle so that we can see the elbows, we can see what they're doing. Same thing with the squat. If you're straight on from the side, then it's gonna to be tough to tell whether you're hitting depth, what's going on with your lower body because the plates will cover things. So try to send videos where we can actually see the body and see the body moving. And lastly, we're only gonna look back through the inbox three months. So go ahead and resend your submissions every three months. Don't resend more often than that because we'll just delete them all if you are spamming the inbox. But we're gonna look back from the current Friday, three months every week when we go in so if you submit, wait three months. If you're not chosen, then you can resubmit. And we're gonna do that to help increase the odds of being selected in a somewhat timely manner and so that your videos are a little bit more relevant. So I want everybody to review this email before you send your videos. If you send your videos and they don't conform to these guidelines, you can't be salty when you're not selected. And if you do send your, your submissions, and follow these guidelines well, then we're gonna pick you, we're gonna put you on Form Check Friday, and you're gonna get your lifts looked at. 